Hello everyone, today we're going to tell you about different widgets that we created for Zoho CRM. The first widget is in a tab home. It's like an import, but only a visual part works here. You can download any file from your computer and press the button start import. After that, you will be able to download a full log. The second widget is in the tab contacts. Here you can choose multiple contacts and press the button widget call. After that, a pop-up window will occur. This is the widget that we created for one of our clients with integration with Twilio. So basically, it's the calls to your clients with pre-recorded messages. First of all, it has the feature text-to-speech. You can personalize the messages that you want to transform to the speech by adding the first name field. You also should choose which phones will receive the call. There's another option of audio file, so you upload a pre-recorded audio file of the call that you want to send to your client. But you have to make sure that it's in MP3 format because other formats don't work with Twilio. And the last tab is IVR call. So basically you give your client some options that he can choose from by pressing different buttons, for example, one, two, or three. So of course, after that, there will be a responding action in the CRM system and all of the answers of your client will be recorded in the CRM. The next widget that we created is for the blueprints in the deal tab. When you press the button where the blueprint is, a pop-up window will occur and there will be a work drive folder. Here you can create other folders, add files and so on. After that, you can click either on close or continue. And when you press continue, the deal moves to the next stage. The next widget is in the tab Sales Orders, and it is created to make tasks from subforms. So when you press the widget Tasks, you can see a row of subforms. You can choose one, multiple, or all of the subforms and create tasks out of them. You can find all of them in the sidebar menu in Open Activities. Another widget is showing a template survey for a certain deal type. For example, if we choose the new business type of deal and press question widget, we can see a form that was created in the CRM system in the module question templates. Here is the subform with all of the questions and values of true false. As you can see, the probability of the deal is 20%. It's because three points of questions are marked as false. But when you mark the questions as true, the probability changes. And later, when you save the form, you can go to Related List sidebar menu and click on the answer forms that creates a record with final probability and the answers to the question. And here you can see the record. If you want to create a template for another deal type, you have to go to the module question templates and press the Create button. You should write down the deal type and the questions that you want to see in the form and also choose the values of the true and false answers. After that, press the save button. Now, when we go to the deal type that we create a question template for, we can find it in the question widget. And the last widget is in the module deals. It is basically an import from work drive, any kind of file to the deal record. So you can store, for example, the recordings of the meetings or any notes that you will need. Except for those widgets that we already mentioned in the video, we created much, much more different widgets for Zoho. And we can develop a widget or an extension for Zoho according to your needs. To learn more about implementing Zoho, creating widgets and other our services, you can book a 30-minute pre-consultation with one of our experts by the link down below in the description box. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, click the notification button and also write down in the comments below which videos you want to see in the future on our channel.